We work across the board with all the NGOs in Belize, but one thing that sets us aside, apart from a lot of the NGOs here, is that we are actually international. We work in nine different countries worldwide, but we are based here in Belize. And um, I've been working on fisheries aspects and working with sharks since 1998. In fact, I did the basic research with whale sharks, spawning aggregation, <clears throat> and several other fish fisheries. And actually, that's really what sets us aside apart from a lot of other organizations, is that we do the hardcore science and research. But how we do it is we do it hand in hand with the fishermen. So one of the key things that we want to do is we want to establish baselines for marine megafauna, so the big animals in the sea. And in doing so, we were working with the traditional fishermen. So they've acquired all these skills and trainings where they can run this incredible monitoring and establish these baselines, not just in Belize, but now they've been moving and working with fishermen in Mexico, Honduras, Guatemala. And also when they're in places like Mexico, they're picking up skills from the fishermen that they're working with there. So this is a whole program of exchange between fishermen, kind of peer-to-peer -peer training that we have been promoting for many years. And because I started the first uh, fisher exchange in 1999, actually, between Belize and Honduras, for example, and now we're, take, we're carrying this much further. And in this particular case, some of the sustainable lobster fishing methods, so fishing with a loop stick instead of a hook stick when you're free diving, which enables you to actually identify the females and the undersized, uh, the undersized lobster more easily and therefore release them unharmed if you're using a loop stick. Some of that was actually brought from Mexico is now being spread throughout Belize because there's a greater onus for actually buying uh, live lobster instead of only dead lobster or getting only lobster tail. So this is exactly what Micronesia wants to do. Federated States of Micronesia, and Ponape in particular, has lobster fishermen, and they free dive. Perfect. So we're taking some of our incredible fishermen and helping advise on some of the sustainable fisheries in Micronesia, where we actually have a program working with sharks and manta rays, but in this case, they need help with their lobster fishery.